retinoid problems, but all those children add up to a whole lot of anxiety about what happens during surgery. And this week's Medical Extra, Paige Parrish takes us on a pre-op tour where the whole family can get a preview. Looking at these faces, it's hard to imagine these kids and their parents are a little nervous about the children's upcoming surgeries. This is important because sometimes you might forget your name and the nurse can look at your arm and read your name. Getting an ID bracelet is the first part of this pre-op tour. In just one hour, the kids, their parents, and brothers and sisters will all feel a little more relaxed. The goal here at Children's Hospital of Illinois is to make everyone familiar with what's going to happen the actual day of surgery. Does that hurt? Nurse Linda Durst explains little things like thermometers and blood pressure cuffs and answers every question imaginable from the kids and mom and dad. Each child who will be having an operation takes home a little pre-surgery confidence as well as a Polaroid. The children that come back in that you knew were afraid and seemed just to do real well, and then the parents that um, you can tell are much more relaxed, and I think that makes a better experience for the children. Put one here, one here, and one here, and you can help, okay? The tour moves on to the operating room itself, where everyone learns about heart monitoring patches and anesthetic masks, which all lead up to the child's special mask. What is it scary that you thought maybe was going to be scary? Um, the place where you, um, get your tonsils out in the at night. Tammy Nickerson thinks her daughter will also be less frightened. Um, I think she was nervous. Um, I think this definitely will help her feel a little bit more comfortable. Does it make mom feel a little bit more comfortable? Yeah, <laughs> a lot more. <laughs> to understand just how important a pre-op tour can be, consider a story that Linda tells. One little girl who did not go through the tour did nothing but scream when the nurses tried to move her from a cart to the operating table. By using a little diversion like, what color is this? She finally talked to us, and during one of the conversations with me, she said, the reason I'm so upset is because I don't know what you're going to do to me. And I thought, oh, if only she would have showed up at the program last night, I think it would have made a big difference that morning. No doubt, a big uh, difference for her parents, too. Paige Parrish with this week's Medical Extra. And the pre-op tours are given every Monday night at Children's Hospital located at St. Francis.